one. Now we shall start as pressing two for two for TI extended basic. Let's first present the system. The system consists in a Texas Instruments 99/4A computer. Uh, well, the console, the console, and the recorder, which is used for saving and uh, and uh, loading programs and data. And this is the uh, TV. This is the transformer adapted for Europe. It also contains some uh, read relays for a remote control of the tape recorder. Well, now we shall load the program. Oh. Well, now you see the tape recorder. It's uh, playing a program which was loaded 20 years ago and the computer will read the program, load it into memory and then we can run it. And the data was loaded correctly. So we have here the programming memory. We shall uh, write size and we got that 10 kilobytes are free so the program is pretty small. Now we shall run that and we shall follow closely the screen. the keyboard at the, uh, at the console, you see the transformer, the, the box of the tapes, and here is the screen now, which will plot a function. Plotting approach is an end, and uh, we see that we have a graph of sinus of fix on x, uh, between 0 and 1000 degrees. Well, the program was loaded correctly, you see, after 20 years. Well, let's have a list. And as you see here, this is, uh, uh, this is the data from the Chernobyl accident regarding the contamination of water. You see? Uh, this is the program which was used to feed the data in order to extract the concentration of the radioisotopes after the Chernobyl accident. So, well, this is the gamma disintegration data for the Chernobyl accident, uh, and uh, we see here how large the, the counting rate was, was about one million counts per second, you know, which is quite huge. And below we have the time in days from the accident up to two years. Well, after two years the activity uh, decreased to uh, about 5% of the initial, but still remaining high. This is in samples of water. Well, this is uh, the fitting data. This is the concentration. Uh, three isotopes have the, oh, three or four have the largest concentration from seven. And here is the, uh, the component of the gradient. The fitting takes one week with uh, this algorithm, which is uh, conjugate gradient.